Hey guys, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. In this tutorial, we're going to talk about how to use Pythagoras to find the hypotenuse of a triangle in 3D. So let's start off by drawing a rectangular prism. So you can see here that I have a 3D rectangular prism and what I want to do is I want to draw a straight line from the bottom left hand corner which is this corner right here all the way to the top right hand corner. So I'm going to draw a straight line and you have to imagine this in 3D because obviously um, this is going across the depth dimension and it's not just 2d it's 3d so a straight line across that so how would i find the length of this line given that let's say the bottom horizontal line is 10 centimeters and going across the y-axis let's say it's uh, five centimeters and going upwards let's say is seven centimeters how do we find this green line so what i'm going to do is i'm going to show you how to do it the long way and then i'm going to show you a shorter way so the longer way is we're basically going to draw turn this line into um, a plane so we're going to turn this line into a plane by drawing from this corner to the bottom corner to the top right corner and then drawing this line upwards so we can see a triangle okay so if i just draw this triangle out isolate the triangle you can see that this blue line is what we're trying to find so this line is the blue line this is what we're trying to find and we have the green line this one going up is seven centimeters but we have no idea how long this line is so let's call this blue line y and let's call this bottom horizontal line let's call that x and x is we, x is what we're trying to find okay so we're trying to find x and that's why there so um, we want to find y based on pythagoras so y squared equals 7 squared plus x squared but we have no idea what x is right now so how do we find x? Well then we would go use the Pythagoras theorem on the triangle at the bottom which is this triangle. So let's highlight the bottom triangle. This triangle right here is also a right angle triangle. So that's a right angle there. Okay so how will we find x based on that triangle? So let's isolate that triangle so we have 10 centimeters on the bottom 5 centimeters here and x so then simply to get that it's simply x squared equals 5 squared plus 10 squared okay using Pythagoras so what have we noticed well we've noticed here that x squared and x squared can be is the same thing so this expression can simply be substituted into where x squared is so then we have y squared is simply equal to 7 squared plus 5 squared plus 10 squared okay very simple so that's what you would do if you want to use pythagoras on a 3d in a 3d context so now we have y squared is equal to 7 squared plus 5 squared plus 10 squared which is 174 which means y is simply square root of 174 which is 
0.19 units long. So that's the answer. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.